Oh, welcome back, audience. Okay, so even though that I never got put on enemy alert once, I finished the mission in less than twenty. I, I finished it rather quickly, and yet I got a B out of it. I was like, I got a B? That's some bullshit. Whatever. It's a disaster. But what else can we do? We've taken away his weapons and banned him from using his nom de guerre. Apparently his real name is Eli. He must feel like we stripped him of his whole identity. We'll let things simmer down. I put a guard on him for now. Still the question is, who is he? Where did he come from? And how has he survived? He's still not talking. No, he won't say a word about himself. But you know, it looks like he speaks English. One of the deck crew called out to him in English, and he said something back. He just lost it all of a sudden, started mouthing off at the guy, in perfect English. He wasn't stringing together words he picked up somewhere. So English is his mother tongue? He could be from the East, or the South, or maybe even further North or South. English is well established in countries all across the continent. It's rooted in Africa like a weed, or maybe parasite is the better word. So just speaking English doesn't help us figure out where he comes from. Could even be from off-continent. Right. In any case, we'll keep an eye on him. If we learn anything else, I'll be sure to let you know. Wow. Gun cam? Okay. Two engineers are being held in the observation post southwest of Ngumba Industrial Zone. Boss. Your mission is to rescue them. The targets are civilians, one male, one female. They were dispatched to the area by an international health organization, but disappeared shortly after. Extract the two targets and help them escape the country. Boss, this contract comes from the Mbele rebel militants. That's right, that general's fighters. Recently, one of their child soldier platoons staged an insurrection and split from the main group. Thing is, they took a hostage with them. The general's brother, his number two. The contract is to extract both that prisoner and the leader of the renegade platoon. The message reads, I love my brother. You must bring him back to me alive. It also says this about the leader of the child soldiers. He is an excellent soldier. I want to persuade him to rejoin the ranks of the righteous. Sounds a little too forgiving for the man who ordered those kids dead at the mine. I wonder... I wonder what kind of persuasion the General has in store. With that in mind, here are your objectives. First, rescue and return the General's number two as requested. Second, extract the renegade leader, and we'll keep him at Mother Base. In other words, extract both targets out of the region. Good luck, boss. Some kind of bioroid? I don't know. The way she moves, disappears. I wouldn't count anything out. Give me a break. It's probably technology from that cipher group. There's no such thing as miracles and the supernatural. Only cutting-edge technology. I don't know much about cipher, but even science has its limits, right? And how do we know she's connected to them anyway? You're asking the wrong guy. Well, whoever she is, boy, does she creep me out. I hear you. <laughs>
I had to get that. And this. I had to get that. Sorry. It was self camo, a stun arm, and a sneaking suit. Bet you left nut I can use something like that. I think I can chill around for my bitch for a couple of bits, at least until the the stuff's done, you know. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, bum nuggets. But it's non-lethal. It's lethal, so I can't use that. Oh, no, 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 no. It's just like, she has like... Like four weapons to choose from, along with three costumes. I thought that was kind of silly, like... She's naked, but something tells me she can have like a like there's got to be some kind of breathing material that she that so she won't suffocate and shit. Rather than, like in blood or gold or silver, that's a little bit far fetched for my taste, mind you. But uh, oh, we're not so far from uh, the silver skin. Awestruck, awestruck. Fucking terrified. I would be too if I saw a naked chick covered in blood. Okay, um. She seems still low, but. Better than nothing, I suppose. Ooh. Oh, it failed? Damn. Yeah. Shit. Starf recruit. How come I failed? Eh, fuck it. Oh, right. Roger. See, like I say, it's kind of from the princess part.
said, if I took him to, you know, took a car or hooked it, that'd have been a whole lot faster than this. First time he's gonna spin around the damn platform before he hits the helipad, man. I mean, seriously. Thank you! See the progress she was making. Ah, the small things don't look too promising. I'm also cooking while I'm doing this. Okay, let me check up here then I'll go on. I wonder how long it's gonna be ready before this battle gear's ready. Any ideas, audience? Yes, I certainly do not. Listen, audience, I'm going to cut this video short because I'm hungry. Alright, so thank you for watching. Uh, like, share, comment, subscribe if you like this video. If you want to see more. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Until next time, audience. Deuces!